Hey, what's up everybody and welcome back to Apps Every Day and this one is great if you are a new parent like me and you want to use Baby Tracker. So this one actually had a recent design update that was much needed. Uh, it was a very useful app before but now it actually looks good. Uh, and basically it is meant to optimize and keep you organized as a new parent with a newborn when the craziness amount of things last happened. So when uh, your baby last fed, when you last changed them, how long they've been sleeping, um, how long you've been pumping, if that's something you're doing, anything like that, this keeps track of. This was crucial. We're not using it as much anymore. Now that he's about two and a half months old, um, it's a lot easier because, you know, now things are in, you know, every four hours for certain things and he's sleeping you know eight or nine hours so it's a lot less hectic now so we kind of just remember a little bit easier but for those first i'd say month or so when you know he's being changed 10 to 12 times a day he's eating constantly and he's not sleeping very long uh, this was crucial because our men mental rate kind of you know goes down a little bit in terms of your memory and uh, sometimes you have to remember these things of when, you know, they last ate and stuff. So anyway, let's say he just ate, uh, then I can tap on this top one here and I can choose what sort of eating he did. So if it's nursing, if it was uh, breast milk, but in a bottle or formula or supplement, anything like that, uh, I could hit, you know, expressed here. And let's say he ate like five ounces or so and then the time it just pulls from the current time keep in mind i'm doing a recording here so uh it always puts 9:41 at the top but it truly is about 4 30 a.m uh, so i'm going to hit five ounces here and hit the little check mark and then boom uh, you'll notice right now it says expressed and then as time goes on if i check this back in an hour it would say express five ounces an hour ago or it would say the time one of the two if you just um want to look at it in different ways you can see different graphs for each of the little things so again sleeping when you last changed them and there is ads obviously there's a pro version if you want to remove the ads i think it's like five bucks upgrade to full version yeah so five bucks removes the ads at series shortcuts honestly for the next kid i'm probably just gonna upgrade because i got a little bit annoyed at the ads um, but we, again, had pretty much stopped using it for now. You'll also notice on the right-hand side of each of these categories, there's a little alarm clock. So if you want to remind yourself to do something, so let's say we need to remind ourselves to feed him, I can go in here and I can say, all right, so maybe we'll nurse at around 8 a.m., and then you can even set the repeat style. So we're just going to do every damn day. Boom. So 8 a.m. So now we can see the little alarm clock on the side. Um, so it knows that at 8 a.m. it's going to send us a notification. Say, hey, this is something that you want to be doing. So do that. Again, very simple app. It is free to download. Again, if you are okay with the ad version, definitely check it out if you're a new parent. And as always, don't forget to hit that subscribe button or like button if you like what you saw here. Let me know down below in the comments what apps you want me to check out next. And don't forget to come back tomorrow for another Apps Every Day. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. And I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day. Now, oh, damn it, Coinbase. Oh, it's up 10%. That's cool. I don't really... Oh. Whatever. Bitcoin. That's a... Uh, conversation for another day. Have a good day, guys.